Now on WSAR's Breakfast Club, it's the Bristol Community College Update. A monthly visit with President Laura Douglas on 1480 WSAR and 95.9 FM. Sponsored by Bristol Community College. Dreams within reach. Visit bristolcc.edu. Well, uh, dreams uh, within reach is a good way to put it, I think, huh? as we have uh, uh, the month of May. And you know what goes on in the month of May, right? Exactly right. Getting ready for commencement exercises. And let's uh, get you the story behind the story, President of Bristol Community College. And uh, good morning, Laura Douglas. How are you? I'm doing well. I think I've got some moss growing between my toes, though. How about you? <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, we've got, uh, well, hopefully the weather will be nice uh, for for the big event coming up on the 20th. And I guess the, uh, uh, the, the, the good news this year is that it will be, uh, well, it's in person, right? Yep, again this year it's in person. It's going to be held under our uh, solar pan- panels on Saturday, March, uh, May 20th uh, at 11 a.m. And uh, if we channel our inner Oprah Winfrey, you get a graduation party, you get a graduation party, and you get a graduation party because after the event we have a big lawn party, and it's really a graduation party for all uh, with music and live music and uh, lots of different activities and great food and just a great place to hang out in the afternoon and celebrate the success of all of our graduates. Wow, that family. is so. a great way to celebrate. No kidding. Wow. Yeah. Uh, it's a real, it's a, a new tradition at Bristol and it's one we're going to keep. And we have a lot of very wonderful honorees for commencement as well. Uh, Mr. Pete Souza, who is a native of South Dartmouth. Uh, he is our honorary degree recipient uh, and he he was the chief official White House photographer and director of the White House photo office under uh, uh, Barack Obama. Well, he must uh, have so some good he stories. He is just a great uh, addition to our lineup of honorary degrees. And our, uh, our distinguished citizen for the year is Mr. Jason Rua. And I know many, many of our listeners know Jason. He's president and CEO of Rua Dumont Audet Insurance uh, with offices in Fall River, New Bedford, and Taunton. Uh, and he's a very dedicated community uh, leader. He sits on the board of South Coast Health, People Incorporated, the Bristol Workforce Investment, Community Foundation of Southeastern Massachusetts, and also Mechanics Cooperative Bank. So uh, hats off to Jason. Uh, we have uh, valedictorian Stanley Den- uh, Denzelowski of New Bedford uh, with a perfect 4.0 GPA and an honorary degree uh, member, uh, just an outstanding uh, individual. And uh, our salutatorian is Victoria Robido of Providence, and uh, she's been fantastic in receiving her degree in history. Uh, and uh, she started a club called the Mortals Club, a student a student club to help uh, explore the space for conversations about death and dying. We have a sanitology program uh, to support people who are dealing with grief, and uh, so she's done a wonderful job there. So we are so excited to celebrate. Uh, these uh, individuals and more at our upcoming uh, commencement. Yeah, I was thinking, I was saying, uh, as you were giving us all the info, I was thinking about uh, the uh, photographer who was with the the White House, the Obama administration. I'm willing to bet he's got some great stories to tell. (laughs) I bet he does, yes. Uh, Very, very uh, interesting individual, and uh, we're just very happy to celebrate uh, one of our own from the South Coast. Yeah, what a great pick, uh, Jason. Oh, my God, he's done so much great work in the community and uh, a great, uh, a great asset to uh, all of the South Coast. Absolutely, yes. And we are also gearing up for our summer terms. We have three summer terms, and, uh, you know, we just keep going all year round at Bristol Community College. There's never a slow moment, uh, but we are registering students right now for our summer uh, courses and also registering for fall as well. Uh, and we have a special program 
program that I'd just like to mention. You know, many of our current students who already are actively enrolled at the college continue on and take uh, classes in the summer. Many of our students are adult students and they go year round. But we also have a lot of students from other institutions, you know, students who maybe have gotten behind because they changed a major or maybe they didn't do so well in a class and they want to make it up. Um, but we have what we call a guest student registration and it's really an easy, simplified registration for those students who are studying at other institutions. Uh, it, uh, you can just Google guest student at Bristol Community College um, and it will take you through the steps of how you enroll as a guest uh, student. So making it really simple and easy for all of our students and of course we have in-person classes as well as online uh, classes uh, and we just want people to remember that uh, tuition uh, payments are going to be coming up soon, May 11th for our first uh, summer session uh, and then uh, our summer session uh, uh, terms start on Monday, June 5th. So that's not far away. So if students are planning to, to study this summer, they should get their act together uh, and make sure they have everything uh, teed up uh, and get the classes that they want. All right, boy. I think uh, you've got a full plate there. <laughs> Lots going on. Good for you. And congrats to all the honorees. And, uh, of course, uh, you, it's hard to believe that the summer courses are just around the corner, man. Yeah. We are so happy that students choose Bristol Community College, Heck. All right. Thank you, uh, Laura, as always. Appreciate it. You have a great month of May, and we'll touch base in the month of June. Take care. Take care. All right. So there she goes, President of Bristol Community College, President Laura Douglas.